all right hello my beautiful Pisces. welcome to your collective reading i hope you're doing very well my friend okay i just finished doing a good meditation it was like before i sat here spirit was like no i'll do a meditation so i did a 10 15 minute meditation and then before that he was giving me some pointers for you okay so this is gonna be a little bit different <laughs> um but yeah welcome there's going to be an extended if you feel called to make that your confirmation my catch has woke up <laughs> probably coming here to confirm <laughs> what i'm going to say to you okay but whatever comes up here you already know you intuitively know especially i'm speaking with high vibrational pisces those who are in the energy of changing and shifting um you know whatever is being taught in the past like i feel this energy of someone like really just like i'm done with this all pardon or things from the past or letting the past hold you back right uh or any traumas or anything like that like i'm speaking with people like really okay let me just say if you have aries in your chart go check out that reading as well okay uh but your scripture is psalm 23 one of my favorites all right and it's something uh spirit wants to let you know something at prosperity all right uh, also check out uh, Genesis 37. That's Joseph's story. Like I told Aries as well. Have some tea shoes, have some tea or something like that. Because when you read the scripture, if you haven't read it, it's very, very deep and it's very intense. So a lot of you Aries and Pisces during this time, you are healing from something like that. But there is a golden opportunity. This card kept popping out before and I was putting it back and it kept popping. Out. I'm like, okay, it has to be for Pisces. Okay. So there is going to be a download, a dream, um, something. It could be this reading or recent reading for someone. It could be a prophet. It could be a clairvoyant. It could be something that God is speaking to you correctly, like directly especially because it comes from the heart right um this energy is just beautiful okay but it says your hard work is paying off okay i also read uh psalm 54 which is divine protection and psalm 91 which is another on top of divine protection more protection prayer you're supposed to be doing this during this time pisces okay you know why spirit just said that you know why and i'm gonna tell you because these pop out as well and he said there is a paradigm. There is like, because these two cards came up like this. So you see there's like the back. So there's like a mirror energy or something like trying to separate or something like that. And then you have the messages. But he said this message first and then this one, okay? But there's something that is trying to prevent you from achieving this golden opportunity, okay? And either way, no weapon against you shall prosper, right, Pisces? Okay. A blessing is on its way. An important door is opening for you that will make you very happy so whoever is attacking this already happening so they have read your fortune telling or something like that without your consent so a lot of you this is going to be like you already know intuitively that they shouldn't this is a spiritual law violation and they're going to get some karma for that okay also you need to be removing yourself from this person whoever this is this could be a group this could be a family toxic member something is just not right and this is why this hasn't come in yet because you need to cut this off okay uh, that video from grieving from something, um, from someone, like, there was a life that I did about someone needed to grieve um, a family member or a friend or something like that, but they're alive, that might be for you, okay? It says a rare, once in a lifetime, a very special, okay? So a lot of you, it's, if you miss this, it's coming back again. So make sure that you are in your alignment, okay? Heart something energy christ consciousness but it says transformation okay this is vital okay and i'm gonna read to you what this is so, so this is what they're trying to prevent whoever this is you know who it is your relationship with a not with one another is about to deepen love conquers and transform all things so a lot of you spirits saying focus on love whoever this is a lot of you you went through a lot okay okay so let's see it says blocking your gifts and talents is in reverse so they couldn't do that your ex karmic partner okay and you see how it's in reverse so it means that it's an ex or something but it doesn't have to be a karmic partner it could be an ex karmic family an ex karmic friend an ex karmic co-worker or something like that something is just this is what they were doing they've been doing it consistently okay also the immature energy they want you to see them not immature okay so there's some um control mind or confusion in here that they're trying to do so they're trying to make you look also this could be them trying to make you look immature but it's not working okay 
lost spell okay there is a lost spell and it's upright so this means that it needs to be delivered or you need to be cleansed from this or god is de dealing with it death spells so they wanted to end something for you okay could be a relationship a new relationship it could be something that it's meant for you okay uh meditation in reverse so this is controlling dreams or your behavior or something like that but a spirit is saying do it anyways because this is they against this they don't want you to tap in okay so and that too it cleanses your energy from this lost spell and and death spells so when you do this meditation 10 to 20 minutes it cleanses your spirit they don't want you to do this do it anyways whatever the enemy is telling you not to do fuck them do it you understand prayers as well they don't want you fasting they don't want you praying cheater they don't want you to see them as a cheater because they are a cheater you know who this is okay also they're telling people that you're the cheater that you're this that you're that but you probably have to walk away from them because they are the cheater okay ego death they don't want you to go through this transformation this heart chakra opening you see it's in reverse they can't stand that. Some of you do it anyways, okay? Faithful. They're trying to make you seem that they are faithful to you or something like that, or that you are unfaithful. It's them, okay? I feel like this is a projecting energy, someone who's like against this. Also, this could be someone that is trying to prevent you from seeing who your true partner, who someone that is a golden moment, an opportunity, as not faithful. That's not true, okay? Use your discernment. Monogamous, okay? So this is someone who is, it says stability in a spiritual monogamy, but there is in reverse. So a lot of you, they want to keep you probably like you don't want to be in like a multiple sex partner or this person is like they want to have their cake and eat it too. And a lot of you, if you're doing that, that's a fucking curse. Break away from that. I'm telling you, whoever wants you to stay like this, they don't give a fuck about you. See, align your chakras. This is something that you need to be doing. Okay. This third party is doing this. You know this. By the way, some of you, this person makes you feel that your actual person is a third party. No, it's them. It's them. Also, you are in a situation like this through manipulation. Look, they're superficial. Ego stuck in 3D, okay? They want you stuck with them. I'm seeing that crap mentality. Like, if you're, if they feel like you're going to be better than them, they're going to pull you down. Look, you're being dual going through spiritual warfare. I can't make this up. Look, they collaborate with others to create rituals to jeopardize your life, your love, finances, and health. Take this seriously. When God reveals is to redeem, okay? Archangel Gabriel, if you don't know who this Archangel is, start connecting because he's been saving you from this shit, okay? Archangel Gabriel is protecting your heart and your throat chakra. I can't make this up. Also, something that you need to speak up, okay? Yes, cleanse your energy, home, body, mind, and spirit. This is why you're being attacked right now, okay, Spices? We're going to tap into this and be extended for sure. But let's see if we have a little bit of time to see what's going on. Spirit, what do Pisces also need to know? And don't worry, there's going to be a sale at the end of December if this is not, you know, you can't afford it or something, okay? But also, we'll do another reading, collective reading in the for you, okay, Pisces? But yeah, see, Jupiter, yeah, someone who's trying to control you, okay? Be aware of this, like I'm telling you. Exploration, philosophical, moral value, abstract thinking, higher learning, Long distance travel, optimism, expansion. It's something that they're trying to prevent you and they're trying to exactly control this rebirth, taking you taking your power back. A lot of you, it's like they're showing you multiple choices and options. It's a lot of stimulation, okay? Some of you are dealing with an Aquarius, okay? Don't judge a book by its cover. Kind thinking outside the bus, the box, humanitarian, independent, spontaneity, open-minded. This is you. I feel like you are a humanitarian, Yo, tap in. The enemy does not want you to be doing this. And there's use in your family. Anybody who you think you can trust. Don't trust nobody during this time, okay? Divine vision, okay? We're definitely going to tap into this, but I'm going to... Ooh, last one, last one. Spirit. For Pisces, what's the last thing? Exactly. Everything that's not done in the dark is going to be illuminated, okay? Open your heart to the enormous growth ahead. Something about a lover's, a decision that you need to make about love, like following your heart. They are two paths ahead. Be true to yourself. Exactly. Pisces, I love you. I hope this is helpful. Go check out this, the extended if you want. I'll see you there. If not, then it's fine. Okay, I love you. Okay, get out of your own way, it says. Discard your project. Projected outcomes and allow yourself to see beyond. Positive focus. Look deeper, okay? If there's something they don't want you to see, go see it anyway, boo, okay? I love you. Stay woke. Huh? If you're in a humanitarian, get going, okay? Because uh, we need your energy, all right?